<laughs> she was trying to be my friend at first. <laughs> I seen that. But I don't, I don't play about that though. Yeah. So I'm fake on, I don't speak on his name. I don't, you I don't can tell she that. was a little bit out of touch with reality she though. Saying, you bitch. <laughs> you ain't talking like that. Shut up. So I mean, like she was talking about Mo three said, "What's up, man?" So you mean to tell me he gonna say what's up, and I say say something I need to know. Nigga, mm. tell me what I need to name this next album. Exactly. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, because yeah. I realize you have the album supposed to be coming out soon. Yeah, I got three more albums. They just gave us When two. is it coming? Uh-huh. Come on now, give us the exclusive. <laughs> I'm pushing for BET Weekend because I want to take over BET Weekend. I want Mo3 billboards be everywhere in BET Weekend. We walk around there having some Mo3 shit. That'll be fly. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Real fly. When is BT weekend? It's like in June, I think. It's in June. That'll be yeah. fly though. Yeah, it's just it's it's just uh I don't know if I'm gonna make it that make it. Why? Cause I got it's a lot of clearances you gotta do. Uh Mo three last uh, Mo three next album, he did a lot of remakes. Um, he remade a lot of songs. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So uh You gotta all of that clearance. Yeah, I gotta get a lot of clearances and then a lot of verses. I got some bad motherfuckers on there. Uh I got no cap and Mo three no cap gonna be a bit a banker. Uh, Mo three, I got a Mo three and Moneybag Yo song. This uh, we trying to get cleared on there. I got uh, the Mo three and Boosie, it's gonna be ridiculous. Way in the water. Mm-hmm. Uh, I got some. Hits How many on songs there. gonna be on the album? Uh, looking for fifteen. Wow, and that's they, gonna that's gonna go crazy. He got, but no, that he got, uh, he got an extension for two more albums after this. You got all them songs in. Yeah, Mo three have over hundred songs. Wow. And you picked out all the best ones to put out now. Mm-mm, I'm 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 building them. You interviewing Steph? Steph said so he yeah. picked up all the good ones. Huh? I'm, I'm just saying. Yeah, uh, nah. How do you pick it with all them songs that he has? How do you pick which ones you want to put out now? I'm building them. I just let God hear me. I, I listen. I was in the room the other day, and I just be in the room sometimes. I be walking around. I got counter lit in my uh, movie room. Mm-hmm. And it's a song, and I ain't gonna tell y'all where this <laughs> song came. Um, and I'm like, I ain't never heard this song. I ain't heard this song in a long time. And three say, hey, we gotta cut the lights out on this one. And they just start rapping. I'm like, damn. So I took that verse and took a hook from another song. Now I made a hit. Oh, <laughs> you I got you. So at nighttime, I cut our lights off. And I, I got you. And I sit around and listen to them. And and when there's something good come on, and then it be chills on my body. I know you're around there like. So you know what? You're going to give everybody else chills when they listen to it. What? I'm going to make all the blogs talk about it again. They're going to swear you lie. I got to ask you this, man, because I seen you on Sco <laughs> TV, and just now that you talked about the, yeah. the gloominess and then the darkness, and then you speaking to Mo3, that lady on there said that she was talking to Mo3. That was <laughs> hilarious to me. I thought, I'm like, this lady tripping. That bitch full of shit. <laughs> She was trying to be my friend at first. <laughs> I seen that. But I don't, I don't play about that though. Yeah. So I'm speak on, I don't speak on his name. I don't, you I don't can play tell she that. was a little bit out of touch with reality she though. Saying, you bitch. <laughs> you ain't talking like that. Shut up. So I mean, like she was talking about Mo three said, "What's up, man?" So you mean to tell me he gonna say what's up and I say say something I need to know? Nigga, mm. tell me what I need to name this next album. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Some. Tell me something. Tell me where I can find some more songs at you. You know what I'm saying? I like, looked at that about three times, me yeah. and my brother. I can't believe I'm saying, boy, Rainwater having hell with this woman. He howling up rough. Yeah, yeah man. Like, them, people, them people on that YouTube be crazy. But <laughs> I don't make a lot of money out of them YouTube. That's why I keep them going. Yeah. I, just, I, book, I book Baby C off straight North Carolina off Chris Co channel. Then I just got another booking for LA. Right off Coach uh, Coach uh, Go channel. Really? Yeah, yeah. A lot of people be tuning in on his channel a lot. But but I think you you got that part mastered when it come down to understanding how to keep yourself relevant. Because he love talking mm, you, mess. No, he ain't really. He ain't really be dr- he be dropping some jewels. No, he do in the too, midst of what's going on. You always have an answer for anything anybody come at you. Yeah, but it ain't talking mess. They just gotta listen. They gonna be listening. They be thinking like right now, people. people I say, man, BJ ain't playing shit. Instead of rappers sit there saying, shit, he right. My song ain't getting played. They be like, fuck that nigga, he a hater. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, I get it. I get it. But you still, you know how to maneuver, bro. Like you be, you be saying certain things. I see you come on certain people channel, whatever. 
But it seemed like you mastered how to no, keep yourself people, relevant, man. Listen, mm-hmm. people don't like to listen to the real. Right up. I learned that. Learned that Charles and White. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.